What's going on, fellow humans and resellers? This is I, James, RedoptionAgency.com, 22 years selling full-time on eBay. And got a little bit more that we picked up on vacation here that I need to tend to. So I thought I would show it first. Got this cool, like, textured mask. That's kind of cool. I might keep that myself. I'll look it up. If there's a name on it, uh, no name. I'll probably keep that. Next we got Build-A-Bear. Not sure who, what character that is. If it's any character, but... At the bins, I always grab the Build-A-Bears, so... We got a pair of pants here. I think Jan got them for her, but they didn't fit. I don't see a name or anything in them, so those might just go straight in the giveaway. Pick this up. This was a Jack Willis Great Britain sweatshirt. Feels quality. Quality. Quality feel is always good. A Simply Vera Wang shirt. New with tags. Uh, we got Yana Shikin. Yana Shikin. Very cool piece. This is quality feeling too, so I got a feeling this might be higher value than your normal $20 sweater. I'm not familiar with the name myself, but I mean, just the buttons alone up here, these extra buttons and stuff. So. And the sleeves are cool. Uh, we got a pair of seven jeans, women's jeans here. Uh, Katie Lee, leopard print shirt, blouse. We got an Adidas performance shirt. Oregon Ducks Fanatics shirt. Yeah, I found this uh, John Mitchell Talbot, he's a Christian artist, uh, sign, shirt, so, work, auto mix, not sure what that is, auto mix, I got found a, got another little bag of toys here to go through too. These aren't all clothes. So. Good vibes, Chris Jansen. T. Never forget. Never, yeah, never forget. 9-11 shirt. Uh, oh, it's that three dog night shirt I found. There we go. Got a cool little vintage shirt here. It's kind of cool. Single stitch. Old jersey tag. We got a Ralph Lauren women's sweater. Uh, J. Crew. SpongeBob thing there. Jan picked us up this hat for Dolly, my puppet. Which I still haven't made a video for in quite a while. Let's see if it'll fit her. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. That's funny. I'm gonna come up with a skit for the hat now. Got some size 15 Air Max. So a nice shape. Pay 20 for those. The same place, one of those Carm stores in the Smoky Mountains. I found this pair for 20. It's a nice pair. I looked them up, of course, so I'll be able to make money on them. 
And then I found this pair there also. And a pair of felines with the embroidered roses. Those were 15. Got a little guy here. Is that from Frozen or is it? Sparkle. Seven. Yeah. What's his name? Seven. It's got some George Moccasins. I think she got these. They're not $19.99. I know that. Probably at the Benz. I don't know where she got them actually. She probably got them for herself and they didn't fit her right or something. She's been talking about finding a new pair. So I got some CDs here and then I got a bag of toys. This is like stuck to me. Okay. Uh, I got Heart Self Titled. I bought it because it's a no barcode version. I found this local band. This was in, bought this in Maryville, Tennessee, I believe. Claudia's Ashes, two sealed and one not. And another one of their CDs. Uh, I got the John Spencer Explosion DVD. Another local thing somewhere, independent, Ten Fingers. Got a Jared Hang Time Jazz CD. Say What Nuclear Fission CD. It's a dollar. Uh, Forever in Your Mind autographed CD. Classical piece made in Belgium. The Hicks. <laughs> uh, Blue Mother Tubulo. Another independent thing. Kate and Roberts. Let's see. Uh, Mano Mano. Al Albita Rodriguez. CD. And normally when I find metal for a dollar or under, I can't leave it behind. So I picked up a couple of Black Label Society albums. And Vermont Nike. This looks vintage, kind of. Let's see. Yeah, not really too vintage, but. And then I got a bag of toys here. I picked up at a flea market for $4. But it looked like it had some older stuff in it. So that's why I went ahead and grabbed it. Let's see. Uh, bummer. He's real light. I was hoping he was heavy. What is he, like a dog or a lion? I guess it's a lion. There's a little name on it. I, hope it... I think this was the main one that made me get it. I don't know if he's got value or not. But from... Wizard of Oz. I can't even see the year. I gotta go get new prescription or something. My eyes have gotten worse. Come on. Got this little Yoda from 96. Skateboard. Can't see what that is. Then we got these little guys, Donald. Huh, got a Yogi Bear keychain, that's cool. I figured one of these small toys should at least bring in $10, if not a couple of them together. So, should have no problem with getting my money back. And then some, Chip and Dale. Ha ha ha. That's cool. It 
for some reason he's vaguely familiar, but I think I might just be mixing him up with Yosemite Sam thinking an old Bugs Bunny cartoon. So I'm not sure who he is. It looks older. Goofy. Got this guy. Who is he from DuckTales or something, I think? No, he was... Yeah, I'm not sure. I don't remember where he was from. Hey! We got her. This is diecast too. Is that... It's not the Berenstain Bears, is it? Dude, I am so rusty on my cartoons, apparently. Hey, I got a wound up mouse. That's cool. Another goofy. A lot of little goofies. Hey, got a Garfield. He looks older too. It's like gnome guy. We got Mickey. Hey, uh, uh, what's his name? Huckleberry Hound, right? That's old. I mean, there's nothing on the bottom of that. That's cool. That's definitely older. Not sure who she is. Not sure what she was part of. A little alligator. And then two more of these guys. All right. So that's it. Cool. This one excites me the most. I remember Huckleberry Hound. All right, and this guy. Maybe I'll try Google Lens, see if I can figure him out. All right, thanks everybody, and I'll see you all in the next video, later.